guys, what's going on? Pardon me if I look all sweaty and drippy. It is umpteen thousand degrees out here. I'm at the Branson Landing. It's like a concrete canyon. But I'm here to try the newest, hottest thing in Branson. Guy Fieri's Kitchen and Bar. We finally got us a fancy Guy Fieri restaurant in Branson. I've always dreamed about going to eat at one. Today we're making dreams come true. Jessica, what do you think about Guy Fieri's restaurant? Well, I think there are more than three restaurants here at the landing. But there's only two I would eat at. One of them is Guy Fieri's Kitchen. I can't wait to go there. So we have arrived. We've been given a paper menu, probably because we're still doing some social distancing type things and for sanitary purposes, you can just uh, remove the paper menu. It's easier than you can wipe down the other ones. I'm about to read this menu, but I guarantee you there's gonna be trash can nachos in my future. As stated previously, uh, we'll be ordering the trash can nachos, which is the Guy Fieri famous. Uh, it's, I've seen it on everything and I've always wanted to eat them. And then I believe we're going to have the bacon mac and cheese burger. We saw a picture on the internet and it looks delicious. Woo! I'm oh, sorry. No, you're fine. Sam is currently throwing a fit. This is why we don't take you out in public. Jessica, have you made your decision? No. It takes her longer to decide. Yay! Trash can nachos. Thank this you. This is what I've been waiting on. Let's see what happens here. Yummy! That looks amazing. I've been waiting to order one of those for like 10 years. That's awesome. Thank you. <laughs> you guys have a great time. Thank you. Okay, the time has come. After years and years and years of waiting, I get to eat the trash can nachos. Oh yeah, here we go. Look at that. That is a big old plate of nachos. Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper. Thank you. Jessica, trash can nachos, make it happen. Oh, oh. Ooh, barbecue sauce. It's starting to collapse. I think she took a load bearing nacho. All right, so the main event has arrived. It is time. I have my bacon mac and cheese burger. Let me show you what we're dealing with. You got your bacon, you got your mac and cheese, you got it. Comes on a metal tray, so it's like you're eating at a barbecue restaurant. Look at that little hand trying to steal a french fry right now. He said, Whoa! You're trying to take my french fries? What do you think, Sam? Is it good? Tell the people what you're dealing with. American Kobe beef burger with crispy onions and caramelized onions and donkey sauce. I guess it's weird I got it well done. I was making fun of Jessica because she ordered a Kobe beef burger well done. I'm pretty sure the guy in the kitchen was like, oh my God. So now we're gonna eat and it's gonna be delicious. There's a lot going on there. You got mac and cheese, you got another kind of cheese, there's a, the donkey sauce, bacon. That is, that is delightful. I'm dipping my fry in that special donkey sauce. The donkey sauce kind of tastes like a garlic mayonnaise to me. It's 
good. This donkey sauce tastes so good in my mouth. It's good, but it's so messy. I can't even keep it together when I'm eating it. It's just big monstrous burger. Right now, I am definitely living the dream. All right, so that's it. That's the end of my big Guy Fieri adventure. It was really good. The trash can nachos were fantastic. The burger was real good. A little bit dry. I need more sauce. I need more of that. The famous donkey sauce on my burger. I like the, I like the way the donkey sauce tastes. It's basically garlic mayonnaise. I'm not going to lie to you. But it's real good. It's a great time. I've always wanted to go to a Guy Fieri place. I've always wanted to get the trash can nachos. I'm so glad I finally got a chance to go. I got one in my hometown now. How cool is that? Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.